What's up guys, Weapon96 here, we are back playing on Harmony Hollow. How's it going everyone? We are back at it yet again with some more Batania stuff. So, um, what we did last time was we made some hydrangeas and we did all that stuff and we made a couple things. We made the, uh, Sojourn Sash and we also made the Band of Mana. Now, here's the thing, I figured something out because I logged in today, I've been playing for about a couple, like, hour or something. It's, it, yeah, I've been playing. Turns out the hydrangeas die, I had to make more, um, they're not super expensive, they just take a bunch of time to make, and that kind of makes me a little mad, and I had to make these again, because you gotta make it symmetrical, and, um, yeah, I, I'm gonna try and find a better way of doing this, because for whatever reason, I read up that they do spawn if they're passive, and that means if I go away, I think I might break them once I leave the server, maybe that'll work, I don't know, um, maybe that might be a workaround, but I'm gonna figure this stuff out, guys, don't worry. Um, today we're actually making a couple couple things. Now I prepped this a little bit. Um, I made I got some Ender Pearls from uh, an Enderman, obviously. Endermen are hard to find. This took forever to find an Enderman to kill him. And I put an Ender Pearl in the Mana Pool, and this will give that gave us the Mana Pearl. So now what we're gonna be making today is a Rune of Mana. So if I remember this correctly, all I should have to do is put that there and put five things there, click it, all right, there we go, and I should just have to charge this, no, not at the crafting table, you dumb butt, towards there, okay, and then it should, all right, so it is making it, correct, all right, cool, so I will be back once this thing is ready, and just give me a minute, all right, so we got it, so now the thing is ready, and it's ready to be crafted, and if I remember, we just throw a living rock on it, and that didn't work, why didn't that work? Wasn't that... That's what I was... Am I supposed to click on it? I was supposed to give it a living rock. I could have sworn that's what I had to do. Right? Oh, you have to... Alright, there we go. Yes, I was right. You just have to shift click with the wand. Cool. So we got that. We got the rune of mana. Or... Yeah, rune of mana. We just do this. And we place that right there. Put that... And we have the Band of Aura. Nice. And now what this does is grip the ring, press B, and open the bubbles menu. Basically, this just creates mana. It's basically a generator like these, but it does it on our person. So does it does it kind of for us. At least that's what I remember this thing saying, right? 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 Book? Am I right? Am I right? Am I right? Band of Aura. The Band of Aura is a bit of a division from the typical Band of Mana, in which instead of storing mana, it slowly, while equipped, creates it and stores it into mana-containing items. Alright, so that means we should be generating mana into one of these. I think it's that one. Look at the little top bar. It's blue. It's growing, I think it is, at least. Right? I'm pretty sure it's doing that, alright? I'm not crazy. Alright. Now, we're also going to be making a couple other things because I thought it would be cool that since we we, we don't really have armor. I'm going to throw on some armor. I'm going to make some mana armor. I thought that would be pretty freaking cool to do. So, I'm going to grab some of this stuff. Um, let's do that. Let's make helmet. That actually, this the armor looks really cool, actually. Dang. That actually looks really cool. What does this do? Okay. So, the armor set, uh, mana affinity, 4-4. 10% less mana cost on mana tools and rods. Okay. 10% uh, land mass cost. Alright. Okay. Mana helmet. Cool. So does that mean just we we require less mana? Something like that? Do we jump higher? I think we jump higher with the belt. I think we jump too high. Not like we don't jump like too high. We jump two blocks high, right? We do. Oh my god. Do we run faster? I think we run faster. Wait. Do we just run up blocks? Oh my god, this is beautiful. Oh my god, this is beautiful. This is amazing. I don't have to jump. Well, that's my old shovel, that it never disappeared. This is, this is awesome. Oh my god, I'm so happy. This is, this is great. Yeah, no, this is... Ah. That's awesome. All right, what else can we do with this stuff? All right, let's see. What else is there to make in this? I know there's, um, we can upgrade these, so we could add a Terra Steel ingot. We might get to that sometime in the future, I'm not entirely sure, but... 
that looks a little bit uh, looks a bit uh, looks a little bit intimidating to me right now. So I'm I'm gonna back off that for a little bit. I want to know what, what this does. What what do we need to make this? We need uh I don't know what that does. I don't know. Mainly the things I picked out were the things that looked cool to me. These things are cool, so we're sticking with it. So yeah. Um. Honestly, I don't really know what else to do. <laughs> I was like, but Tan, you'll probably take a little while. Um, we're only like six minutes into the video, so I could end it here. Ooh, I guess I could show you guys my farm and how it's been coming along. Let's show you the beautiful farm, peoples. Let's do it. Harmony Hollows has been a little bit, I'm not going to lie, on the back burner just because it's kind of hard to come up with things to do on here. I don't know. But Tanya's like the only thing I've been working. Ooh, I run? I think I run faster. That's cool. So the farm's still going really well. Everything, I've harvested like once or twice, um, depending on how fast they grow. These crops don't grow fast, and I think it's mainly because there's no sun, and I kind of was like, yeah, lava will work fine, right? Yeah, that'll totally work. It's not, it's not working the same as the sun. Apparently plants need sunshine and need to photosynthesize. I, I, I speak funny. Um, yeah. Also, we were never able to get the lava uh, thingy to work. Our lava pet. We still have all of our other pets. I might get... Probably gonna do a run for pets. Just trying to name things that we can possibly do. Try and collect tons of pets. I know you can make them, but I kind of want to find some of these. I don't even know if you can find any of them. I think you have to craft some, but... Like, our walk-on lava pet, it just kicks us from the game. Which I'm not happy about, and I don't think there's any fix for that. At least not for me. Apparently, uh, Brittany, uh, Saber, and Popsy didn't have any difficulties with it. Maybe the game doesn't like me. That's entirely possible. But uh, I'll see what I can do because we I do want to go to the nether and I do still want to make better tools. Um, and we're probably going to adventure into that stuff with our new mana armor just because it looks awesome. Um, but guys, I think that's really going to be it. I don't have anything else for you to show you. It's just kind of a little do with thingy on Harmony Hollows. So, yeah. Thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to like, favorite, comment, subscribe. Let me know what I can do in Harmony Hollow, please. I have absolutely no idea what to do. Ooh, probably going to go to the Nether in the next episode. I don't know. Give me ideas because my brain is poop. And yeah, love the Pop Fam. I will see you guys in the next one. Bye. Bye.